Sitaram, Namaste, good evening. Welcome to yet another episode of Prem Bhakti Kiyawas, a program that features our youths of our community to exhibit their talents and their abilities to this culture of ours. This evening program is dedicated to a very special day. And what is this special day about? Can anybody tell me? Yes, it's Mother's Day. And when? Tomorrow. For us, every day is Mother's Day. But the Western world put aside one day as this special day for all mothers. To all of you wonderful mothers out there, I wish you a very happy Mother's Day. To do our opening selection, I would invite Bahinji Devika Sabai to do a short prayer, followed by a rendition from Bahin Anita Ji. Vinarare vipula mangal daan shile Bhaktar tinashini viranchi hare shabande Kirti prade kilaman rorat daam hare Vidya Pradayani Saraswati Naminityam This prayer is mean. O Mother Saraswati, your vena is ever providing divine songs throughout the three atmosphere. You grant good fortune to all. You remove the afflictions of your devotees. You are the bestower of fame and the fulfiller of all wishes. You are the fountain of knowledge. O oh, Mother Saraswati, bless us and protect us night and day. Hari Om Shanti, 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 Hari Om. <laughs> Thank you. 
God hears more than we say, answers more than we ask, gives more than we imagine in his own way and in his own time. Be patient because God loves you. Namaste. For all your video and photography needs, invitations, digital albums, studio portraits, and much more, they're professionals in the business since 1980. Catering for all your wedding ceremonies, receptions, sweet 16s, parties, and much, much more. You can contact them at 718-843-1668. Planning that special getaway? Pan American Travel and Tours can surely help. Whether it's a flight to your favorite hotspots around the world, or that dream cruise you've been thinking of, we have the lowest fares in town. Visit us at 12209 Liberty Avenue on the second floor, or you can call Ina Passat at 718-848-0000. Tax time is here, and we are equipped with a competent staff to service all your tax and insurance needs. Again, visit us in the heart of Richmond Hill, 12209 Liberty Avenue on the second floor, or call Ina Passat at 718-848-0000. Zero, zero. Looking for luxurious homes or apartments? Visit Zara with two convenient locations, 16607 Hillside Avenue, Jamaica, Queens, New York, 11432. Their telephone number is 718-415-8833. Second location is 451 Fulton Avenue, Hempstead, Long Island, New York, 11550. Their telephone number is 516-292-6071. They have studios, one, two, and three bedrooms, furnished or unfurnished, with short or long-term leases available. Call for an appointment today to see these luxurious apartments. Again, Zara Luxury Apartment and Homes, with two locations, servicing New York. 718-415-8833 or 516-292-6071. The Bachelor Group of Prem Bhakti Mandir will present to you an acrostic. M is for the million things she gave me. O. O means only that she's growing old. T. T is for the tears she shed to save me. H. H is for her heart of purest gold. E. E is for her eyes with love like shining. R means right and right shall always be. M. O. T. H. E. R. Put them all together. They spell mother. A word that means the world to me. Now I have the privilege to introduce to you Mataji Kaushilya Sankar, who will do this evening's Pravachan for us. Very talented and renowned personality in our community. Friends, join me in a short prachana. Varina Maritha Sangana Rasanam chandasam api Mangalanam chakartaro Vanne vani vinayako Hari om shanti 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 hari om Sisters and brothers, it is quite true that the entire world is going to celebrate Mother's Day. On this episode of Prem Bhakti Ki Awaz, we'd like to share with you a little bit about Mother. All religions of the world proclaim that mothers are our earthly gods. For we believe, and it is truly said, that God is the creator of this universe. And mothers, they are the procreators. Her love, her sacrifice, and her unfathomable love is beyond explanation. 
a poet beautifully says, and he says, Mahe Mohabbat Kanam. Another name for mother is love. To all our mothers, those of you viewing this program, Prem Bhakti Ki Awaz would like to send out a cautionary note. And that is, we have our children, and it is important that we love all of them equally. Yet for all, sometimes, because of the way we as mothers may act, or the way we may say certain things, we sometimes show preferences for one or more than one of our children. It is therefore important for us to be balanced and to treat all our children in the same way. Many children, sometimes they complain how their mothers have been unfair to them. Many sons would complain and say that their, their mothers have been unfair to them, their wife and their children. And likewise, daughters, they have also complained, made many complaints that mothers, sometimes we have been unfair to them, their husband and their children. We have seen this to be true with many families. And that is why today in many homes, many families, there is chaos, there is corruption, there is pain, and there is a breakdown in the family relationships. Although the entire world proclaim mothers to be God, mothers to be love incarnate, yet for all mothers, our decision making need to be carefully analyzed. We need to be balanced. We don't need to be biased towards our children. Because as children, they grow up, they nurture animosity, they nurtured hatred, they nurtured indifference to us. We have found that many, many children, when we, we talk about how great is mother, they sometimes has a thing or two to talk back and to say that their mother is not that much, much educated to behave in such a manner that scripture prescribed for them to behave. Let us look at the story of Bhagwan Sri Ram. He was given 14 years of exile by his stepmother, Kaikai. He was overjoyed to obey her commands, although he was not a biological child. Yet when he went to his mother, Kaushilya, for her blessings, she, Kaushilya Ma, had to make a decision for the benefit of all. She did. Like an educated mother, Kaushilya Ma made a decision because she had to think about her son. She had to think about herself. She had to think about her husband. She had to think about the other brothers, Bharat, Lakshman, and Satruharna. She had to think about the citizens of Ayodhya. And likewise for us too, O mothers, when we make decisions and when we try to be balanced in whatever it is that we have to do in regards to the family fabric, we must do so in a very, very intelligent manner. Kaushilya Ma, when she heard that her son had to go to Banbas, she was devastated. She was in pain. She was in turmoil. Yet for it, she, she knew what was her conduct. She knew what was the dharmic law, and she did not want to violate the, the dharmic code. And so she thought to herself, she said, if I ask my son Ram to stay back, I am going to go against the principles and the codes. If I ask my son Ram to stay back, although he is my only loving child, I am going to cause animosity among the brothers. And if I tell him to go to exile, it will be a great loss for me. And so, friends, this mother was caught in both dilemma. She was in grief. However, it is said she understood her wifely duties. And she knew that both Ram and Bharat was dear to her. She was aware of the need to be impartial. And this is what sometimes many of us mothers, we cannot understand. We need to be balanced. And Kaushilya, in a very gentle tone, she summoned up great courage 
And she said to her child, Ram, she says, my darling child, you have done well because obeying your father's command is the greatest duty. Had it been your father alone who would have sent you to the exile, I would have tell you don't go. But your mother, Kaikaima, has also given the command. And so, as a command by both parents, you need to obey them. Friends, examine ourselves in a situation like this as mothers. What kind of a decision would we have made in connection to our children and to the future of our family? So as we celebrate Mother's Day, Prem Bhakti Ki Awaz would like to throw this cautionary remark to all of us. We do so with great pomp and pageantry, but at the back of our mind, or oh mothers, we need to be careful as to how we make decisions in regards to our children. We need to treat them all on the scale of equality. We need to be balanced in our treatment. I trust hope that these few words will enable all of us to be more balanced in our treatment towards our children. Hari Om Shantihi Shantihi Hari Om. Cleaning, specializing in residential and commercial buildings, hydro jet cleaning service, video camera inspection, sewer and water main repairs. You can contact Mike at 718-657-7235 or 347-401-3831. Central Auto Repairs and Body Shop, Complete Car Care Center, New York State Inspection, Mufflers, Brakes, Air Conditioning, General Repair, Complete Body and Fender Work, Painting, Insurance Appraisers. Contact Dave at 718-738-2252 or 718-322-1400. Law Office of Rajesh Subhai, located at 110-10 Jamaica Avenue in Richmond Hill, Queens, New York offers professional, reliable, and reasonably priced legal services. Rajesh Subai has over 10 years of experience in all real estate transactions, landlord and tenant disputes, immigration, bankruptcy, mortgage foreclosure, and modification. Contact Bhai Subai at 718-925-89. This is a song dedicated to all our mothers coming from our youths of the temple.
So we are here uh, in Texas, the state capital, and you can see the huge building here. The devotees, they are enjoying the scene here. It's very beautiful. A lot of excitement. Baby does how the trip um, so far? Wonderful. You enjoying Excellent. it? Yes. Okay. What about uh, Leela? Very exciting. Hi, New Yorkers. We are having a good time in Texas. Ah. Now, fellow viewers, we are here at uh, Austin, Texas, and this is a, a wonderful scene here. We are seeing that uh, the uh, background, we can see that a beautiful temple there, and we have with us here uh, Swami Nikolananji. And Swamiji, please explain where we are here. Oh. We're on top of Barsana Hill, which is the place where Radharani had her palace 5,000 years ago when she and Shri Krishna were on the earth planet. So this is our Barsana Hill uh, representing the Barsana Hill in India. And it also looks very, very similar to if you go and walk on Barsana Hill, like the trail we came up, it looks almost, you won't even know you're in a different place. They look just the same. So that's where we are. <laughs> And a special birthday greetings going out to Randy Ramdin. Greetings are coming from his loving family, friends, and the devotees of Prem Bhakti Mandir. Happy Janamdin. The Yakasari Humanitarian Group invites you for a special program on the 3rd of June, 4 p.m., at the Fairfield Pavilion. Donation. Adults $15 and kids $10. Hoping to see you there. Also coming up, our ninth Yakasari reunion on the 24th of June at the Fresh Meadow Park. Hoping to see you there. A lot of entertainment, singing, dancing, cricket, tug of war, lime and spoon, one's eating competition, and much, much more. Hoping to see you there. And now for our bus trips. 
23rd and 24th of June, Niagara Falls. First week in September, Golan Temple, West Virginia. Second week in October, Austin, Texas. First week in November, a tour to India. Give us a call and enjoy these wonderful tours. Fellow brothers and sisters, devotees all, Prem Bhakti Mandir invites you for our Sunday morning satsang from 9 to 11 a.m. Choose the evening Hanumanji Puja and chanting of the Hanuman Chalisa from 6 p.m. to 8 p.m. Thursday evening classes, tabla, dancing, Hindi, and singing from 5.30 to 8 p.m. Enjoy these wonderful opportunity. To wrap up our program for this evening, I would like to extend again Mother's Day greetings to all the mothers out there. Join us for satsang tomorrow morning, 9 to 11. But before I do so, I would like to give these few words. Honor thy mother and father. Our parents are our gods in human forms. Worship and praises are done to them first. Join us again next week, same time, same channel, for our next episode. Jai Sitara. <laughs> Oh,